Good morning, guys. The congregation is going to help us out, so don't drift off. I <laughs> um, didn't see everybody. I want to uh, say something we say every year around Easter time, and I'm going to say a phrase, and they're going to respond because they know what it is. And I bet if you haven't said that, you already know what it is, right? So you guys, do you think they can do it? The congregation can do it. I, I'm feeling pretty good about it. Okay, here I'm going to say this: Christ is risen. He is risen indeed. Hallelujah. Now, did you hear them all say that together? How did they know what to say? We say it all the time, right? Is it in the bulletin? It's actually not in the bulletin, right? It's not printed out anymore. It's not on the wall. How did they know to say that? Because the church has always confessed these things, right? But we know that Jesus died for our sins, right? Everybody here, Christ has already paid for all your sins. That was on Friday, and then he rose again on Easter Sunday. And since that time, the church has been saying this, and we're going to do it again, but I don't want to teach you guys this, because I think some of you know it, but I want us all to learn these phrases. I have my line, and your line is four words. He is risen indeed. That's five words. He is risen indeed. Hallelujah. I'm not good at math, am I? A five words. You guys got it? He is risen indeed. Hallelujah. So let's try it. I'm going to say my part and everybody respond. Congregation. Christ is risen. He is risen indeed. Hallelujah. Now, the reason I want us to know that is we say it at Easter, and as you know, Easter is a Sunday, but Easter is a season also. But then this other thing. When can I say that? All the time, right? All the time. Because Christ, he died on the cross, and he rose again. So guess what's true now? He's still risen. Isn't that right? He's still risen. Christ lives in heaven, reigning on his throne. And so he rose from the dead, but he remains risen forever. So we can continue to say it. And adults, the reason I want to share this with all of us is I've noticed that sometimes I say it like in different times of the year. And I catch everybody not ready to respond. And here's one of my things that I always do. Every single time we have a funeral, some of you have seen this. If we have a funeral and we're out in the cemetery, I think we need to confess, right? That Jesus Christ. And so I always say it. And we had one this Friday. And guess what half the people did? They did nothing. They looked at me like, you can't say that on Friday. <laughs> Can I say it in July? Can I say it in August? Can I say it in October? Can I say it at Christmas time? I can, you're right. So we can say all the time that Christ has died for our sins and rose again. We will always be alive for us. And you guarantee that's my own age. Let's practice it one more time. Christ is risen. He is risen indeed. Hallelujah. Be ready for that anytime. You never know when I'm going to pop up. You guys can 